Yamaha did not change its Raptor 700 and YFC 450R mechanically for 2011, but the special edition versions are tweaked just a bit with a new look and some tidy features. Two days of riding in the glamorous sand dunes of Southern California was a great way to experience the Yamaha ATV lifestyle. Our home base was a caravan of trailers and we split off into groups to explore the exciting terrain and unbridled performance of class leading machines. The 450 looks more sinister than ever with black and red bodywork with a metallic vertebra graphics. Fenders are held on by simple quick release fasteners for easy maintenance and a black DYTR grab bar is installed on the front. The swing arm is blackened as well with a gold drive chain providing a sharp contrast. Underneath the slick exterior is the proven 449cc 5 valve engine. Crisp fuel injection and a 5 speed manual transmission feed power to a wide 50 inch wheelbase. Motocross ergonomics and a 405 pound claim weight make this $8,949 Sport ATV easy and effective to throw around. The Big Boar Raptor retails for $50 more. It has an even darker outlook with all black bodywork and subtle phantom graphics. A special front grab bar, custom GYTR heel guards, and wave style rear brake rotor come standard, and both machines tread on new inner rolled wheels. Yamaha also provided machines equipped with additional GYTR accessories, like graphics, airbox mods, a fuel controller, and exhaust. Where the YFZ builds power quickly and high into the RPM, the Raptor is a torquey monster and turns out wheelie-inducing power right off idle. The 700 motored up the steepest hill glams could offer without even breaking a sweat. And after a few tries... And this is China Hill. This is the big one. It pisses me off. I want to make it. The smaller 450 topped the mountain. Both sport ATVs are right at home on the sand, and their versatility for motocross and trail riding make them very popular machines. Mm -hmm.